Alright, so let me walk you guys through what we've got going on today. Um, what we have is a 6 kVA uh, transformer here uh, that we're running from a 32 amp uh, 230 volt mains supply. Uh, presently the transformer is tapped on a one to one ratio, so 230 volts in, 230 volts out. Uh, purpose of that uh, primarily at the minute is for some nice mains isolation for us. Uh, we also have the facility here to change the um, voltage uh, that we're feeding to the inverter. Coming out of that uh, we go into this uh, rectifier here which was uh, kind of a very crude but fairly beefy uh, design uh, that I had from back when I was messing with welders. Uh, here in series with the DC output uh, from the rectifier uh, we have a heating element uh, from an inje injection molding machine and that's really upper operating here as a kind of a safety resistor uh, so that we can't draw too much current from the system should something strange happen uh, with our inverter and gearbox. It's a, nominally about 12 ohms uh, of resistance um, in circuit. So we come out of this and we go into the inverter and uh, I've got a voltmeter here which is telling me I have 320 volts DC on my bus. Uh, this is the first time that the inverter has seen high, high voltage uh, DC um, also. So it's a test in, the, in that way. And we have our Lexus Hybrid uh, connected up to MG2. Uh, here I have a rag uh, just behind the pump port uh, just to catch any oil that's being ejected. And I'll, uh, we'll be talking more about that uh, later. So, without further ado, uh, let's go spin it. Alright, so, uh, with the parameters as they are now, uh, I'm going to put my safety glasses on, because I'm scared, and we're going to give it gas. Gears are kind of starting to complain in there, um, as you could probably hear, and I don't really want to run it too much without oil, because uh, that's going to be our next job, will be to get some oil in here, because we now seem to have been able to establish the ability to run this uh, reasonably well at high RP, RPM. So let's do one more time. It's a little bit jumpy there at the low speed, so that we need to address. Now, for crying out loud, I do detest auto power off multimeters. Try again. And backlight, please. Thank you. Ooh. Yeah, I'm not liking that banging going on in there, so I think the time for oil is going to be... Regen is working. 
Japanese mosso. Folks, so as we just saw, uh, we've made some pretty serious um, inroads on driving our Lexus um, hybrid gearbox and um, definitely getting closer to the point where we would be getting some confidence in it, uh, actually putting it in a vehicle and putting some load on it. Um, but in the meantime, um, in parallel we're kind of working out the control strategy uh, I need to be starting to look at this at this oil pump uh, situation and I'd say that'll be the subject of a, a quite a um, uh, <laughs> be the subject of a video uh, that we'll be doing fairly soon uh, so as as always uh, thanks for watching thanks for subs subscribing and uh, we'll be back soon.